When I'm given the coordinates of the endpoints of a segment, PQ, and I'm trying to find the midpoint of it, what I'm going to do each time is I'm going to space these out and line them up vertically. So I'm going to erase Q and put them out here farther. The reason why I'm doing this is I'm leaving spot for the midpoint, which we'll call M here. Anytime we have a midpoint, we know that the distance between P and Q, M is going to be halfway between that distance. So what I need to do is I need to find the distance between each of the two y coordinates and the two x coordinates and just split that in half. So what you'll see is that the distance between 2 and 1 is 1. What I need is these two small distances to the midpoint to add up to 1 and to be equal to each other. So I'd have 1 half and 1 half. So my new midpoint would be 1.5, which is halfway between 2 and 1. If I find the distance between P and Q, it would be negative 7 from negative 1 to positive 6. I need to split that in half. That would be 3 and a half. If I added negative 1 and 3.5, I'm going to get 2.5. So the midpoints of my midpoint, the, the coordinates of our midpoint would be positive 2 and a half and positive 1 and a half.